this is Tyreek's um cartoon about Dr. Umar <laughs> making fun of Dr. Umar. This area looks kind of weird. I hope I'm in the right spot. Greetings, my brother. Welcome to the Buster Douglas, Mariah Carey, Tevin <laughs> Campbell, Patti LaBelle School for Boys. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Greetings, my brother. Welcome to the Buster Douglas, Mariah Carey, Tevin Campbell, Patti LaBelle School for Boys. How can I help you, my brother? I'm currently working on an undercover operation, and I need some of your Pan-African students to help me infiltrate an FBA event so that we can sabotage it. I'll make it worth your while financially. Well, I appreciate your offer, my brother, but we currently don't have any more students here at the school. Wow. What happened to the students? Some of them didn't want to come to class, and they wanted to hang out on the corner. And I'm not going to be able to psychologize them off the corner. Some of them had to be put to sleep. For how long? For good! Mr. Bucci, you do understand that you're now in court for a third degree stalking of a man. I'm innocent. Just because I'm obsessed with Tariq, that doesn't mean I'm stalking him. Well, there were several eyewitnesses who said they saw you lurking around the Black History Museum. Prosecution, would you like to bring a witness to the stand? Yes, yes, Your Honor. Um, I'd like to call a Mr. Eric Mays to the stand. Now, Mr. Mays, we do understand that you are a hostile witness. Yes, I'm hostile. I was just trying to enjoy my banana pudding at a senior citizen's brunch at the Black History Museum. I didn't know I was going to be involved in some damn case about a big booty bow. Hold up a minute, Mr. Mays. You're out of order. You out of order. That bear's out of order. That ugly man sitting over there with that red hat and that pineapple-shaped head is out of order. Ew, is that how you do? Mr. Mays, if you engage in another outburst like that, I'm gonna hold you in contempt of court. Do I make myself clear? Yes, you do. That's it, contempt of court, contempt of court. Prosecutor, you wanna bring on your next witness, please? Yes, Your Honor. Um, the next witness is Hollywood actor Morgan Freeman, um, who happened to be at the Senior Citizens Brunch at the museum where Mr. Bucci is accused of stalking. Mr. Freeman, can you please tell the court what you saw when you were in the vicinity of the museum? It was a dark and dreary night as I temporarily stepped out of the museum to go to my vehicle to retrieve a bottle of hot sauce for my chitlins. I briefly came around the corner to the image of a bear with the widest hips I'd ever seen. It was a heavy set bear. It was a sassy bear. It was a musty bear. And the scent from that bear penetrated my nostrils like the scent of mint julep tea at the crack of dawn on a warm Mississippi morning. But in this case, it wasn't the crack of dawn. It was the crack of that bear's ass that I was smelling. Objection, Your Honor. This is just a bunch of babble and hearsay. Ob <laughs> That's crump, man. <laughs> Objection sustained. My client is not a stalker. He simply has a man crush. He was born with a chemical imbalance that makes him attracted to men's. That is why he's built like a hermaphrodite. 
as you know, California just passed a new non-binary law that allow men to pursue their fantasies without any judgment. In other words, if he has wide hips, you must acquit. Well, based on these new non-binary laws and this other information, I'm going to have to dismiss the case. Case dismissed. Yay! Yay! I won! I won! Order in the court. Order in the court. Now, Mr. Bucci, if you continue to bussy pop in the court, I'm going to have to hold you in contempt. Take that, prosecutor. How do you like those apples, Morgan Freeman? In your face, old man. You better get away from me before I kick you in them wide, child-bearing hips of yours. Oh, no. A hundred feet, a hundred feet. I gotta go. Cheeks don't fail me now. Hey, Booty, get in the vehicle. We need to talk. What's this about, Bob? Well, Booty, I had to pick you up here because we dodged a bullet with this court case you just had. The cover for our operation was almost blown, so I can't have you coming up to the FBI headquarters right now. So what's the plan, Bob? Well, it's time for you to go deep undercover, Booty. Next week, there's going to be an FBA luncheon there at the Black History Museum. It's going to be a red carpet event with celebrities and other guests there. Okay. We have the secret powder that... We're going to have to get back to Bucci Bear later, man. Shout out to Bucci Bear, man. <laughs>